Hey everyone, so my name is Sahil. I'm the co-founder of this wonderful software, XNAV. Um, the idea of this company is to change AV forever. There are no AV companies, there are no software companies who let you design end-to-end -end AV solutions except us. Take you uh, to a quick demo. So you basically get started with one of our templates. So we have huddle room, classroom, meeting room, town hall, cafeteria, network room. So you have a bunch of templates. Uh, hotel and public address are coming up soon. Um, so it's very easy to add a design. So there's two ways of doing this. One is we take you through a series of questions and answers. Um, you tell us about the products you want, what you're trying to do um, based on your selections with and the brands you want, we pick products for you on the fly. We keep going that way until you complete your bill of material and boom, you have seven wonderful documents generated automatically for you. Um, there's one more way of doing this is if you already have a bill of material and you just want to design. Um, go to our portal and find your stuff, keep adding them, boom, you're done. You click generate design, you're done. So I'll take you over to an existing design uh, so we can, I'll go in edit mode and I'll show you how it works. So this is an already completed design. So see there's four sections, general, video, audio, and control. Uh, general section, we ask you for your room dimensions, your seating capacity, seating pattern, your video sources, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, then you move to video. Currently, it's all my answers are saved, so I'm just moving over. We ask you for your in video, your room orientation, uh, if you need a display. All the questions that you see here are generated dynamically. So all your further questions are going to be based on your previous answers. There's no check, 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 yes, no, it doesn't work that way. Um, we also have these tool tips everywhere. So just in case you're not sure of any option, you just hover over, it will tell you. So just like the screen, it will tell you uh, for general viewing is for watching videos and uh, maybe video conferencing. Basic decision-making is for presentations. So we ask you where you want to put your display, the resolution you want, then we fetch the brands that are in our database that match your selection. You select one, multiple, how many ever you want, and you click find products. So everything on our platform is Avixa standard. So according to Avixa, we tell you your ideal display size is 76 inches. The nearest available we have on our platform is 80. You are more than welcome to select Avixa standard, or you always have the option to do your own size. So in this case, Let's see, we go 60 to 70 inches. We'll add that to our bill of material. Specify the quantity and it's added. As you can see the notification to the top right, bill of material, we will see it's added here. So we had a different screen earlier. It has replaced that one. So this is how it's going to work for each item, each category and subcategory. So similarly, projector screens, we ask you some details, what you want. Again, everything dynamic. Uh, projectors, we we'll ask you for video conferencing. You want hardware-based, software-based. Do you want USB cameras? How many, how many licenses, Kodaks? We ask you everything. Um, your switching system, which is very complicated, um, but we have nailed it. So you go over all these details, tell us, what you're looking for, the poor details, um, how you want the connectivity pattern of your transmitters and receivers. Then we show you your options uh, according to the brands that you've selected. Similarly, we move to audio. Do you need audio? Yes. We show you the options for microphones, different types, even wireless ones. Speakers, we show you. You want ceiling, wall mount both, your coverage pattern. Uh, the ambient, uh, the noise level, the headroom, the material of your room, if it's carpet, it's absorbing, if it's uh, 
marble and glass, it's reflective. So, you know, you might want to consider the beamforming speakers. You tell us your uh, preferred brands, we fetch results for you. Same thing with amplifier, it will depend on the kind of speakers you selected. Same thing with DSP. Then you move to control, we ask you um, what kind of control system you want. You want touch, wired, wireless, the size, the keypad you want, how you want everything to be connected to your control system. And you even have some passive items like cable cubby and uh, racks. So once your bill of material is complete, you hit this, as you can see, you hit this one magic button, generate design. And the internet here is kind of slow, otherwise it's a matter of like two or three seconds. So here it's, uh, it's done. So it's barely seven seconds. Bill of material, what you just saw, you can download an Excel or PDF, edit that on the cloud, whatever you want, or own drawing editing tool. You enter in that, it looks like Microsoft Visual that's online. So you see that? You add stuff, remove stuff, make connections, delete connections, draw new connections, have your own symbols here, um, do your own branding there, send it to your client. You can export this in these different formats, including PDF, Visio, and even AutoCAD. So you download that as a DWG file. Next thing is, if you have a ceiling speaker in your design, we will tell you how the coverage pattern of that looks like. So here we have 12 ceiling speakers, edge to center polar pattern with a 90 degree coverage angle. Then we have a scope of work document. So everything we went over, every questions, uh, all the questions we answered and all the technologies were involved. We put all that in here, we document that for you. So you don't have to manually write anything. You're more than welcome to edit this out, add stuff, delete stuff, however you want it. There's one last thing, specification search. This is something outside the design, kind of cherry on top. Um, Consider something, any piece of equipment, let's just say a ceiling speaker. So if you're wondering, I know the specs of a speaker, but I wanna see my options, what brands make those specs of speakers and what their pricing looks like. So we go here, brands, let's just say, no, no preference right now. We give some specs and submit, and we will fetch all the different speakers from all the brands that meet those specs with their pricing. So that was our tool. Uh, there's also, like I mentioned, another way of doing your design by uh, adding your own bill of material. I'll show you that as well. So it looks something like this. So here you type in anything, like I type, Samsung, anything. So whatever you have in your existing bill of material, you type it here and then you click, you click generate design and all the documents that you, you had gotten by answering those questions, now you have them right here without going through that workflow. So yeah, that's, we've gotten phenomenal response at Infocom here in Orlando. Um, <laughs> very overwhelming i haven't sat down for a minute my throat's killing me so that was it hope you guys like it yeah have a good day